It won't help me, but it will help my son. Frankfurt resident Lori Staley decided to enroll at classes at Ivy Tech in Lafayette after years of working in a factory. Now, her son Mark will attend the same college this year, but he won't have to drive as far next year. He'll still be going to Ivy Tech when they open the Frankfurt ca campus, so. So that'll be great. Clinton County and Frankfort City leaders came together Monday night to take the first steps to bring an Ivy Tech campus to town, a project expected to cost $2.5 million. Mayor Chris McBarn says during the meeting, the city entered into an official letter of intent to Ivy Tech. To solidify all the small finite details that it will take to fund this project effectively and get it off the ground by fall of 2013. Officials also voted on a declaration of interest to purchase the Frankfurt Times building as the planned site of the Ivy Tech Center. McBarn says this location will help boost economic development for the city of Frankfurt. Students walking back and forth to buy coffees and pizzas and steaks from our various restaurants and shops. What this will also do is it will work to connect our downtown to our I-65 corridor. McBarn says if the Frankfurt Times building is purchased, the newspaper will relocate to another building downtown. He says the city's next step is to raise money to buy the Frankfurt Times building. McBarn says the city is already well on its way. We have a very generous anonymous donor who's already put $150,000 into the private side of our monies to launch this capital fundraising campaign. Staley says the new center and its location will keep other young people, like her son, close to home. Once those students graduate, then they will get jobs here and then that, you know, will stay in Frankfurt. Staley's son hopes he will be attending Ivy Tech at this same time next year without the hour-long round-trip drive. Reporting in Frankfurt, Brittany Tyner, News Channel 18.